contains fictional characters and do not take it in real life. I repeat, do not take ID personally. It doesn't related to idols personally. They are just in this fictional characters in this story and I am doing voiceover. So if you don't like voiceover, you can mute this video. And if you still don't like it, you can kindly leave this place. And maybe it can be a bit dramatic as well. Because after all, it's my imaginary story, not a real. And do not repeat this story of mine. Storylines are edited by me. Thank you. You can enjoy it now. Sorry for taking your so much time at first. Why N? Because it's not about feeling. It's about heart and soul. Jaimin. Oi stop being dramatic he rolled his yes seeing you dramatic lines and focus on what you're here for but I guess you are focusing on something else you said wiggling his eyebrow playfully. Taehyun. Yeah. I heard your new boss is so handsome and hot. Why or N? Jerk and annoying too you said annoyingly remembering earlier incident like how he behaved like haunted ghost for getting late to give his coffee. Why N? But wait. You know, I found that strange aura, like someone is using power and it was familiar to me you said remembering familiar aura as you. Jaiman. Are you thinking what I am thinking? He said thinking the same thing as you that it must be him. Taehyun. But I don't know what you both are thinking he said innocently, making both of them facepalm. Jaiman. Damn this stupid alien shut up now he said dragging him while you follow them. The next day. You were running late for your so-called office but what can you do it's just you're doing it for dear soulmate. Why N? Aish this damn. Heels how can girls wear this and walk like in model daily you were frustratingly walking while tripping and stumbling over your own heels. But to your bad, your one heels got broke down in the middle of crossing road. Making you curse that heels badly. You sit in the middle of the road to fix that heels. Not noticing the vetchels are running like in the racing game. But your focus was only in the heels. Try to fix it. But when you can't fix it, you take both of the heels in your hand. And ready to walk in your barefoot. But when you get up, you saw a car running to you like bull speed. In reflex, your hand frees everything with power which make you alive. But little did you know that everyone got freeze. But there is still one person who didn't got freeze by your power which you didn't notice. Move out from there and make everything normal. Author. Is there is any kind of these things in real life no right then just imagine. In the office. And you're looking like a zombie walking with only one heels wobbly legs and being all sweaty everyone is looking at you weirdly because like who comes in the office like this in the second day. Of course. Y or N. Who else? The only monster of Gion Empire of Vampire World. But they don't know yet from where this creature belongs. That's why they find her little weird. Y N. Damn. Because of that crazy heels I got late and now how am I gonna face that mafia looking big boss? He will eat me alive because I am freaking two hours late you were mumbling and running towards your boss cabin to face him. You knock the door before going inside. And there he is going through some files still not looking at you. Y N. Good morning big boss you great politely so that he won't get angry on you but damn he hard face you scare. Jungkook. Aren't you a bit early for this miss why and you frown in confusion? Jungkook. I mean it still have some hours left for tomorrow's morning he said sarcastically. But you dumb brain won't understand what he was trying to say. Why and no. I mean I am bit late for today's morning that's why I am saying it now so good afternoon Mr. Jeon. You again greeted him properly so that he won't find you suspicious about you. But to your luck he isn't in his ice face today and is talking causally with you. Yn. Are you really that scary big boss from yesterday? Yn. You said in your mind confusingly like who? Isn't he getting angry on you? Like literally yesterday he behaved like haunted ghost for getting his coffee late and now he isn't asking about being late for freaking two hours. Jungkook. Yes I am shit is he reading my mind? Yn. What? Mr. Jian you try to act innocent after making whole flashback and comparison of incidents with him. Jungkook. I know your innocent face and your brain can't match and your stupid brain how it work he is talking like he knows you since childhood. Which you doesn't realize and he himself don't know how he is getting your expression. In just one day you literally laugh hearing him saying your face innocent but your brain stuck in that single word stupid. Yn. Yeah. How dare you call my brain stupid. Yn. Oh shit. Why or N control your stubborn anger? He is not your soldier that you can rule over him like in your palace you mentally facepalm your for almost getting you inner self out. And here he also don't know why he likes to talk to you so much. And make you annoy for no reason. He is feeling it since the moment he meet you in the party. Author. And viewers you know it very well why they are feeling it like this right smirk. 
YN. And you he cut it off her. Jungkook, let's go, we have meeting he said with his same authorative tone, making her think that he have dual personality. YN, oh our big bish I mean boss is back she said while walking behind him. Jungkook, and wear this before coming in meeting room. He literally throw that box in her face. And guess what? It was a shoes for her which she broke earlier and that's why he guessed that she was late because of this girl's things which he forgive he this easily wow. If it was other, then the person wasn't going meeting room. Instead that person got already out of this building. But lucky her. YN, oh he is sweet and how did he know that I broke my heels? She is thinking about his sweetness but he smile drops when he said her. Jungkook. Don't think that I am sweet to you. It's just I don't want my secretary to look like a beggar who can't afford shoes. Too he said, making fun of her or just want to cover up that he was seriously being too much sweet with her. But before she could say anything, he move out that cabin. Y or N. Damn. What am I even thinking about that jerk you were cursing over him while wearing your shoes and go in meeting room? In the meeting room, every is in the meeting room and there was that sweet guy too whom you meet yesterday Jope and the next one was tall and have handsome face who was sitting beside Jungkook and talking about something or maybe the about the meeting with the client whom they are waiting for. You are getting bored, but suddenly someone walked inside. You were not interested to that person, but when he greeted you, you immature. Look at his face making your eyes got widen. Jimin. Hey nice to meet you my name is Park Jimin. He said with same flirty smile, causally pretending that he doesn't know you. Taehyung. And it's me Kim Taehyung, nice to meet you you got another shock seeing this both how come they become client. Jungkook. Miss Wire N. Wire shock seeing you own brothers and pretending like you don't know each other he asked suspiciously, seeing your reaction. YN, my brothers, your brain is still functioning like what they are planning and they didn't even tell me. Jimin, oh why or nah don't be angry that we didn't tell you that we are coming to your office. Taehyung, yes we wanna surprise our little sister he pinched you cheeks making you give a look meet me alone outside I will f king kill you both. They were being casual outside, but they were literally shaking inside. That your inside is burning? Like, why didn't they tell you anything but here the one person observing this weird behavior of three siblings. Jin, okay end of this siblings get together shall we start our meeting please. The moment you three saw his face, they found that something is familiar and some connection. He also feels that same connection when they first encounter them, but never got depth in it. All of them in the meeting were feeling strange connection between like they all are family but hasn't discovered yet they feel like home. But something is stopping them to be like family. Jungkook. Okay let's start the meeting. So this is meeting between Jaimin and Taehyung's who are clients. Don't ask how they become, you know it already. And Joe who is second head of company. Jungkook and Jin who are partners of companies. Causally they all three are friends. And why or N you know it vary from which groups she belongs to. After the meeting. After finishing the meeting everyone was going outside Jin Jope and Jungkook was discussing something and walking ahead and so you grabbed the opportunity and pulled both of them by back if there's shirts collar making them almost choke. Why N? Now you both tell me how the hell you got here. And the first thing, why didn't you inform me about this plan? And how the hell you become my brothers you pinned both of them in the same meeting desk from earlier, asking like a strict teacher who is asking homework from backbenchers. Jaimin. YN. Jibel please don't threat us like this. We just came to help you you let go of them because they are here for your help, not tease you or trouble you actually. You said some suspicious power here right? And remember that white pendant you got from our empire? You nodded. YN. Yes. I kept in the depth of water so that Noon will get to know about that. And mostly he he won't feel it your power is from water. That's why you can do it, Jaimin. Yes and if that pendant got contact with your soulmate it will glow red. Jaimin. If it glow yellow, it means it's our empire family who come with him. And lastly, if it will glow black. It means he is no more, right? And see your pendant? It's golden. That means you start using his power and found about your rival. You understand? That's why your pendant became golden yesterday after finding suspicious power around you you are seeing it through your vision from your mind, YN. That means he works here, Jaimin nodded. YN. That means he works here, Jaimin nodded. Taehyung. And I also got the information that he has some fire sign in his left arms like you have water sign in your right arms if this two sign get connected then that pendant also will glow red. Taehyung. 
and in the party, your boss saw both of us with you. That's why we saw, we are your brothers oh, that was so much informing you're getting at once, why un, and you are telling it to me now why don't you tell me earlier you said because if you get this information before it was easier for you. Jaiman, actually, we also got to know it today as I was reading the book that was given by our father means king. He is everyone's father in the empire family and they said this book will only open when your pendant glow golden. Jaiman, which did yesterday only. That's why I was able to read the given information from the book it was book where some past are written. But you pendant need to have specific glow to read every pages. YN. Looks like you're getting close to me day by day. I am coming to you prince. You smirk knowing you're getting close to him. And disappear from there to get that pendant out from the water. But there was someone watching them. I am sorry for not posting regularly. I thought I was good at writing but I am not I am sorry I got demotivated I wrote my storyline but I thought it wasn't good enough but I still try to write good stories for you as much as possible. If possible, write something motivation for me in the comment section that will motivate me and write my further story as fast possible, because someone is waiting for my story, right? And thank you for loving my stories, even it's not that good.